Hello everyone, welcome to Command Wolf Gaming, I'm CWG, and welcome to March Forward, or Forward March. Either or, it sounds both exactly right. So, this game is all about base, the basic concept of a military battle, uh, where you actually kind of gotta go and you gotta charge into the battle and basically destroy your enemy. So, uh, you set up your different groups, uh, or different formations, but you only get one or uh, two teams to work with and one is the primary team one is the secondary team and when i mean secondary team i mean like one has one type of uh, weapon and you know sub like a shield or archery or something along those lines while the other one uh, has uh maybe something else you know it's a different type of weapon or sub or whatever so uh, now, generally, I, I've been finding that the cavalry is not a very good unit to have on this any of these maps whatsoever. Uh, I just did this for the intro, you know, just for the poops and giggles. Uh, so, um, so most likely, I'm gonna probably just reset this <laughs> map so that uh, I don't have to embarrass myself by dying uh, in the most gruesome of ways. Because obviously, I'm currently engaged with these enemies, but I'm not doing much so all right let's just reset it all right so this is what you're going to be looking at at the very beginning so you got first team second team and you can choose basically how your loadout wants to be basically you can either do the infantry or cavalry um then so you can choose either or, or those uh, i was using cavalry before uh light armor or just regular heavy armor and a couple different uh, mains and a couple of different subs uh, now, the second team is always inherent of your first team uh, class and armor-wise. So basically, if you select infantry with heavy armor, your second team is going to uh, reflect that. However, since we're going to be do uh, doing it that way, obviously, we kind of showed that the cavalry was kind of useless on the map. Um, we are going to be using the first team. We're going to be using uh, heavy armor. We're going to be using infantry. We're going to use mace as the primary weapon. Uh, and then we're going to go down to down here. Mace as the primary weapon over here. And we're also going to do the heavy, heavy. Um, that's I think that's called a war hammer. So we're going to go like this. And now you see all the controls right here. This is all the different formations and things we can do. So obviously we can use the mouse and keyboard to set up these formations or we can do um, overlap formation or we can do uh, you we can click on these accordingly and they'll change up the formation uh, uh, in conjunction to that so we already uh, lost a couple guys right here close up formation density get in there boys come on let's take care of these guys It's just a melee of death and destruction. Keep at it, boys. Keep at it. I don't actually don't know where. The, uh, okay, so the these guys in the right here, th those are my guys. These the black and white guys are the enemy. It looks like I'm being out. I'm murdered. I'm probably gonna die shortly. Let's see how many men I have left. I don't think I have any left. Oh no, I do have. Oh, never mind. I did it. <laughs> Whoopsie. Um, okay, so it might be better if I take care of the guys that are coming from the foothills. Those are the light infantry or light armored uh, units. So what I'm going to do is so I'm going to use the mace. I am going to use uh, the shield. And I'm going to keep this guy as such. And I'm going to rebalance that so it's 30-30. Um, yeah, we'll keep that like that. We're going to do uh, overlap formation. Right, so the overlap formation, each group is mixed in with the other, and we're actually going to head directly for these guys over here, and we're, maybe we should expand out a little bit. So there we go. So these guys don't have any archers, so I'm just going to group up together as much as I can. There we go, and hopefully we can take care of these guys. Lickety split, then we can worry about the archers at our back. Because those are going to be a major issue shortly.
Okay, take care of these guys. Get. Okay. Spand out. Or wedge. Whatever. Get in formation! Keep going, boys! Keep going! Charge! Ugh. And it's a slog fest. Let the weapons roll over. Let the clatter of metal and steel smash upon thy enemy. For they know nothing of true combat. And neither do I, honestly. I think I'm just kind of like dumb luck. Okay. Pull together, boys. Pull together. Back out. Back out. Back out. Looks like we still have some enemies. Square it out, square it out, square it out. Forward. And there we go. Nice and semi-clean victory. Alright. So, uh, the cavalry is not going to be useful on this map either. And the reason why I say that is because of this river edge right here. Generally, the cavalry is good on an open plane if you're facing like light units. Uh, because you're able to punch through them. However, if you have a heavy unit with a uh, shield on, forget about it. You're not going to go anywhere. That's typically like your death sentence there. Um, so we're going to do infantry. We're going to do spear, sub weapon. We're going to do uh, the shield. Because this spear is actually good against uh, cavalry. Then on this one, we are going to keep... We are going to stick with the mace, but we're going to use the crossbows. Crossbows are actually kind of a nice thing to have. We're going to do, um, yeah, we'll do that. We'll actually, no, we'll do that as a little bit more of a balanced crew here. So we're going to actually meet, uh, now this over here, I believe that's cavalry unit. If, by the way, it's moving fast over here is just a regular, uh, foot unit. So we're going to expand this out a little bit. We don't want to give them room to charge. And the reason why is that because if the if they end up charging, they're actually going to get uh, more damage in on us than we expect. So hold formation. Close. Keep getting into them. Oh god, I can't tell where my guys are. Yep, I only got one guy. <laughs> Alright, second team. Mace. We're gonna give them a big old hammer. And then, yep, heavy shield. Da, da, da. Go like that. Actually, we're, let's see if we if we meet these guys right out the gates. And it is stay kind of like in the water or around the water. Maybe that'll give us a better advantage against the cavalry. <laughs> okay, let, we'll try that again. Because I feel like we had that. Uh, we're going to do actually against armor this time. That and that. Start that. We're going to do overlap formation. And we're going to do... Where is it? Um, increase formation density. Try to make it as hard as possible for them to hit us.
There we go. All right, let's try one more. Uh, I don't like this. I can't use cavalry here because of the water, right? I'm sure they'll probably have a long distance unit here and probably something here as well to bottleneck it. So it'll make it 20 times harder to even do this. So what I want to do is use, how about let's try it with light armor. We haven't tried light armor yet. Uh, we'll do the main weapon as a sword, sub weapon as shield, secondary. We'll, okay, we'll do some crossbowmen and we'll do some, uh, we'll, we'll also do the mace and we'll do equal parts uh, squads. So, okay, ooh. I love the attention to details. Okay. And I feel like as soon as these guys are gonna start, uh, yeah, I was right. So it looks like they have a bunch of archers up here um, that would defend this circle. Round! Widen, 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 widen. Keep widening out. Okay, so we're going to do it like this. So, oh, okay, so there are units behind there. Oh, I guessed right. I guessed right. I can't believe I can. Uh, all right, so we're just going to basically... Now, the archers don't have an infinite amount of arrows. So I think the best thing for me to do is actually just allow them to spend all their arrows. Then we'll pick off uh, the guys that are actually probably down below. And then uh, we'll move on to, you know... Uh, taking out the rest of the archers in fact uh, I might have wanted more shield units than I did archers but we'll see in a minute so be right back get in get in get in get in start smashing away at them charge Nice. <laughs> Alright, I want to retry that again, but with more shield people. Okay, so we're going to do that. We're going to do light armor. We're going to do... We're actually going to do 20. Actually, no. We'll do that. Crossbowmen. Maze. First team. We'll do the mace as well. Um, actually, we might be able to get away with swords on both. Alright, let's try that again. Wow, okay, so that worked out better than I planned. Uh, rectangle formation. Get them a little closer together. Let's move up.
There we go. <laughs> oh, man. All right, cool. So that is pretty much the game of March forward. Um, the, obviously, there's a couple more levels here. Four or five. You know, there's just a couple more to uh, try. I've, I did all the training stuff because I kind of want to skip over that. And uh, it's a very simple gameplay. I'll make sure to leave uh, the link down below so you guys, if you want to, if you're interested in playing the game, feel free to go and download it. You know, play it for yourself. And anyway, thank you guys for tuning in today here on Command Wolf Gaming. And before we wrap it up, did you guys know that 90% of you guys are not subscribed to my channel? That is right. 90%. It is crazy that you guys are not subscribed to my channel. And I know you love my uh, material because you guys are tuning into my channel. So make sure to help a guy out by, you know, hitting that big red subscribe button down below. And as I always say, guys, like, subscribe, and share. Spread the love. And I hope to see you next time here on Command Wolf Gaming. Now, now keep, keep your, your hand, hand off that, that mouse, mouse folks. folks. We, we have, have so much more fun and exciting content on this channel that you guys and guys are missing out on that it's not funny. So all you have to do is hit the big red subscribe button right down below this video. Also remember to hit the bell notification button. You can't miss it. It looks like the Taco Bell bell just without any color. And with doing that, you are officially subscribed to my channel, Commander Wolf Gaming, and will receive notifications on when new material is up on my channel for you guys and guys to view and enjoy. If you like what we are doing, Hit the thumbs up button, if not hit the thumbs down button, but remember to always leave a comment or a suggestion down below in the comment section. I want to know what you think, and I want to hear what you guys and gals want to see in the gameplay, but as always folks, like, subscribe, share, and spread the love, and I hope to see you guys next time here on Command Wolf Gaming.